I figured I better bring you along for at least one pass of the oh the mountain we call it. It's a really steep. Uh, hills and stuff you don't want to roll a wagon or bust something so it takes a little longer to cut it and takes a little longer to chop it you gotta take your time take it easy so it is what it is at least it's tonning up like a son of a gun so that helps a lot it's your time well worth of that time doing it then Well, we got a little rain. I maybe maybe a tenth. It uh, really rained uh, north of us there. 
anything they got. I don't know, I haven't heard nothing yet, but sounded like some nasty stuff up that way, so. Focus. Oh. Yeah, but anything better than nothing. That's not from rain. <laughs> That's from the water toad. So I use that for uh, putting water in TMR. It runs over. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna show you. We got a little, a little shot of rain anyway. So sprinkle a little bit now. I'm getting rain over that way. Well, I figured I'd share that with you. Slowly but surely, we're making progress over here. <laughs> I got, uh, we got that one finished up now. And, uh, I finished cutting. I got one little grass strip to cut. That's back there, you see that pole? Like a, uh, I don't know, it's like three quarter acre grass, man. Even that till later. And uh, so we're done basically over here. And then there's a hay strip down this way. And then the guys have been with me for a while. We gotta go down the hill, over the hill, through the woods, and over across to get to the other stuff. So. I'm gonna shuttle wagons back and forth with a 43. And I got my buddy Larry, he's helping haul with a pickup. So he's hauling them home and I'm just bringing them up. Not gonna be that much over there, so. But there's this field right straight ahead of us, not very big. A filbert grass, hey. That's a straight fungicide on the beans. They look like they're dying.
minutes so far. <laughs> we got a grass strip that goes all the way around this field here. And there's a field in the back, so there's Casey waiting for me. So. Grab wagons and head back. That's hay here. <clears throat> I got cut in this over here at, uh, well, I cut, well, I cut it to say around 2 o'clock today. It's, uh, what is it, 8 o'clock right now? I mean, you kind of see it. How dry it is already. It's unreal how fast it's drying, so. Huh. Doesn't help that it's getting overripe, but it's still, it's just. I've never seen a dry so fast. Oh, we got a low tree with us. You can stay over here. All right. I may bring it back when I'm making the climb up out of here. She barks pretty good, so. over here again and I got back over here and uh, yeah I lost my gears <laughs> it's happened before I think what it is is there's a pin in here that makes your shifting mechanism up with your linkage luckily I got 13 millimeter with me so I'll take that apart. It's happened more than once. I gotta fix the shift from this tractor, anyways, because as you can see, the roll pin's busted in there. Somebody special did that for me, so. Haven't got that fixed yet. Definitely gonna fix that, because this tractor's gotta go in the shop, anyways, because it needs a clutch. PTO clutch went out, so. Well, I'm gonna get it. See if I can. See if it is a pin and. Bring you guys back, I guess. Yeah, the stupid cotter key snapped off. Hairpin, whatever you want to call it. That goes into that there, so. Now I put this back together and there's a chopper that I'm in the way of. <coughs> and I'll bring it back.
fourth gear. Ooh, halfway up, she ain't lagging it. I just put that load in. That's the last load I can fit in there for right now. Last night we were, Charlie was filling and uh, pipe plugged on him and plugged on once before, but that was uh, a little too much in the pipe. But yeah, that's nice. Got that full. <laughs> I like that. We got 33, four acres more to cut yet. Silo's full. Sweet. All right. We're ranking a little headway, I guess. Well, I come back over here. Got a little left to cut down there. Uh, and this farm is done. So, that's good. And then we're going to move over to the other farm there. Uh, it'll probably be after Sunday. Hopefully, we got a good chance of rain on Sunday. So, hopefully... Fingers crossed, we get rain on Sunday, which is tomorrow. And then we'll go back at it and knock that down, or I'm going to bail it up. So, that'll be in another video. So, I'll call this one good enough. And, uh, yeah. Well, guys, thanks for watching. Like the video, and catch you on the next one. See ya.